Jesus, the great teacher. Jesus was a great teacher, the best ever. Christ listened to him. Jesus told them to be merciful, good, and kind. Others may hate and hurt them, but God would care for them. Jesus taught many things. He said, God's people light up the world the way a candle lights a house. What's the difference a candle makes in a dark room? The people Jesus spoke to believed in difference, an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. But Jesus taught kindness, forgiveness, and love, even towards enemies. In Jesus, in Jesus' day, some people pretended to be very holy when they gave money to beggars. They had a man blow a trumpet so everybody would look. Do your giving in secret, and God will reward you, Jesus said. Jesus told the same about prayer. Some people prayed on busy street corners so everyone, everyone could see and hear them. They didn't care about God. They care about what others thought of them. Jesus called them hypocrites, false actors. Jesus often used nature to explain his teaching. For example, he pointed to the birds. Your heavenly father feeds them, he said. Don't worry. God will also feed you. Even rich King Solomon was not as well dressed as the ladies. Jesus continued, If God causes the grass of the field, will he not also close you? Jesus was teaching people to trust God who provides for all our needs. If you judge your brother, it's like trying to take a speck of salt dust from his eye when you have a great big log of wood in your own eye, Jesus said. Perhaps people talked, but they hard to think of his meaning. Jesus said people should ask God for help. Do earthly persons keep a lamp of stone when hungry children ask for bread? No. They keep good things. God also keep good things to those who ask. Jesus is a great teacher, warned about the first teachers. They dress like sheep, Jesus said. But inside, they are oops. He said, first teachers would be known by the leaves they did. In the story he told, Jesus showed that people who obey God's word are like a man who built his house on a rock. A terrible storm arose when it ended, the house stood firm. But a fish may build his house on sand. When the storm rushed against it, it fell apart because of its weak foundation. Jesus said that people who do not obey God's word are like that man. 
The crowds were amazed at Jesus' words. They had never heard such things before. Now they knew it was not enough to hear God's word. They must also obey it each day. Jesus, the great teacher, a story from God's Word, the Bible is found in Matthew 5 to 7 and Luke 6. The entrance of your words keeps tight. Psalm 119, verse 130. The end.